Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. That is the R and the RK Stumbling Bear. And this is my Poetry Thursday. So, I promised David Wiley I would do a Poetry Thursday. I am not normally a poetry fan, but my sister has given me a poetry book called The Essential Neruda Selected Poems. So Pablo Neruda was a Chilean poet, and according to Wikipedia, he wrote in different styles, including surrealist poems, historical epics, overtly political manifestos, a prose autobiography, and passionate love poems. Now Neruda is a Spanish poet, and so this book is unique, wherein it has the Spanish poem on one side and then the English translation on the other side. And I know she gave this to me because I speak a working degree of Spanish. And, you know, the idea is I don't have to look at the English. I could practice my Spanish, but if I'm not up to it, I can look at the English. All right, these poems are translated by a team of translators and on the bottom of each translation, they have the initials of who did the translation. And in some cases, it looks like one did the primary translation and two other people helped. So at the beginning of this book, I went, there's a quote from Pablo Neruda, and I want to share it because I think that even if only David Wiley watches this, he's going to really love this quote. On our earth, before writing was invented, before the printing press was invented, poetry flourished. That is why we know that poetry is like bread. It should be shared by all, by scholars and by peasants, by all our vast, incredible, extraordinary family of humanity. And I think that is a great quote. I am just not as well versed in poetry. So the poem I have chosen from this book is from his collection, Heights of Machu Picchu. And this poem is called From Air to Air. Now my pronunciation of Spanish is not the best. I mean, let's face it, I have a heavy Midwestern accent when I speak Spanish. And the people that I have to speak Spanish to are very, very understanding when I am talking to them. So I am going to read the English translation. From air to air, like an empty net, I went wandering between the streets and the atmosphere, arriving and saying goodbye, leaving behind in autumn's advent the coin extended from the leaves and between spring and the wheat, that which the greatest love, as within a fallen glove, hands over to us like a large moon. Days of live brilliance in the storminess of bodies, steel transformed into the silence of acid, nights unraveled to the last flower, assaulted stamens of the nuptial native land. Someone waiting for me among the violins found a world like a sunken tower, digging its spiral deeper than all the leaves the color of horse sulfur, and deeper still into geologic gold, like a sword sheathed in meteors, I plunged my turbulent and tender hand into the most genital terrestrial territory. I leaned my head into the deepest waves. I sank through the sulfuric peace and like a blind man returned to the jasmine of the exhausted human springtime. So if you are a poetry fan, it, maybe try it out Pablo Neruda if you haven't already. If you speak Spanish, if you speak or read Spanish, you would probably be interested in this copy so then you can see the Spanish and then see the English translation as well. Or just read the Spanish and forget the English translation. Thank you and have a good day.